In January 1919, the Spartacist uprising, led by Rosa Luxemburg and Karl Liebknecht, aimed for a socialist republic. Facing the uprising, the Weimar government, led by the SPD, enlisted the right-wing Freikorps, including the Guard Cavalry Schützen Division, primarily composed of ex-soldier paramilitary volunteers. Luxembourg and Liebknecht were captured and subsequently executed, igniting the White Terror with thousands of communist and socialist casualties. In 1920, the Freikorps went on to seize Berlin after efforts by the government to disband them. Simultaneously, the 1920 Kapp Putsch, a right-wing coup attempt led by Wolfgang Kapp, opposed the Weimar Republic. They were fueled by discontent with democratic reforms, concessions, and the Treaty of Versailles, worsened by France and Belgium's occupation of the Ruhr due to Germany's early reparations default.